Chris, you're trying to wash the paint off. Look at the inside of my car. Now, now we have, I have a lake. while I'm driving. I like how I have to run it, this key, all the way, the only way to get unlocked is to run it so it, so I'm uh, fucking with the starter, messing with the starter. It knows it's gonna get killed. I think it just killed itself. This thing's been stalling out in the pits. The steering wheel's been locking up. It's clear that we have a car on our hands that knows what we've been saying about it. It knows that we're gonna kill it in its next night of action. And it is trying to do everything it can at this point to not make it there. That is the weakest horn, by the way. That's the, that's the excuse me please horn. You're not gonna let me out. Right? Okay? I'm supposed to get out. Please move. I'm trying to get by. It's okay it's if you don't want to move. From Lego Movie. It's the, it's Fluttershy. Beautiful. The dents are hard to paint. I have to look good. But it, I want it to look good. If it looks good, it'll feel good. It'll run good. Matt. Yeah. If you can take a dying cat and put it in a dress, it's not gonna feel good. So what we gotta do is we gotta get a new one of these. So we probably might have to run to the auto parts store. See if we can just get a brand new 1990 it's written on here somewhere. 1992 Volvo <laughs> station wagon tie rod. This thing's gonna look like a pile of crap. Yeah. Good. All right. That's good. I don't even know where my. Uh, other this thing is gonna look like something that's gonna be pulled in a train race. That's all I gotta it's say. It's gonna basically like be the ugly Christmas sweater paint job. Hey, hey, hey I like that. <laughs> good. Heads or tails for white cars. Uh, heads. It's white. Blue. It's tails. And and yellow. It's uh, tails. heads. Tails. What did I say? I don't remember. Okay. <laughs> I guess we're a yellow car. I know we use training in karate, but that is the least efficient way to paint the fence. Isn't it? Yeah. They didn't have rollers back then in the ninja days. That wasn't Sport. in the ninja days though. Yeah, it was. The karate kid? Mm-hmm. They don't do karate nowadays. I thought that was in Reseda. Yeah. You didn't break it enough. You didn't break it enough. So what's your uh, inspiration behind this paint job? Um, I'm not sure yet. I'm kind of thinking crash test dummy because he did it, or he wanted to do that before. 
Yeah. But just obviously incorporate um, low budget TV and stuff. Yeah, I like it. And then uh, Sarah's going for the ugly Christmas sweater. What? Does my radio work? Maybe it's something against this car, huh? Matt, you are doing a masterful job. Oh. The Lincoln Continental is getting a new pair of shoes. Rocco's Modern Life. Yeah. That was a hoot. This one. What are you doing here? As the sun sets here at Arundel Speedway, work continues. Uh, you see behind me, all the painting continuing on. Sarah and Shayla and Matt have just been hammering out that paint, uh, covering up those cars, making them look like our own. Now, both those cars are gonna have different looking paint jobs than anything else we've ever driven. Uh, we just told them, have fun with it, do whatever you want, so. That's what they're doing, they're having fun with it. Uh, Right now, I'm heading over here because there's one thing that will require work from our pit area, and that is we have a couple of uh, bolts to get off of a fan. I need to get this fan off. Once we do that, this car will once again have donated another piece. For, I mean, at some point, we're going to probably try and fix this station wagon over here. And when that day comes, we're gonna be like, dude, there's nothing left inside. It's soon gonna be literally worthless to even hold on to, so. That's pretty funny. All right. So this big daddy is lifted up, so. Do we see the washer? It should be a little discolored from everything else. I know I'm gonna see it on the video, but not see it right now. It's like Blue's Clues right now. Where's the glue? Wait, I won't see the clue. It's right there. Well, Tommy might have another one of those washers. Luckily, I have three of the four, so if we needed to get another one, it's just kind of one of those pains in the ass because it's like we had everything. And something as simple as dropping in the dirt can end progress. I'm surfing on a light fixture. Hopefully, no one ever sees this video. <laughs> Well, folks, it's happened. It's just past seven o'clock here on October 18th, 2014. And this number two machine that you see before us, look at this, look at that. What? A little bit better than chicken wire. Yeah. I think so. So this is our, uh, our new windshields that we're gonna have on these cars. And more importantly, ignore the tires because those are gonna be a very easy, we're talking a five minute fix on this thing. Besides tires, this car, is ready for night of destruction. That's ridiculous. We're gonna move this thing. I need to swap tires on this because if you'll take a look over here, that one's nice and small on the front end, right? Well, this one, you can see the uh, size difference just a little bit. Well, this one and this one are the same size. However, we have absolutely no clearance right now between the body and the tire. And we could just put the smaller tire back here and we should have, uh, Maybe some room. We're probably still gonna have to take care of this, either cut or pull it out. And we all know how much I like to pull it out. What it is, Big Mama? We're, no, because there's no flat in Yeah, that's what I mean. It's you like, can't, these aren't made to tighten around this kind of thing. So there's another way to get that out. Well, there's a hole. I wonder if there's like a, a pin. See this hole right here? This is what we're dealing with. We tried, we were told that maybe this is where it unscrews. This piece. However, there is a hole, it looks like a pin maybe. Like a set screw or something? Someone's looking at this on our video right now going, you guys, it's so obvious. 